Okay, guys, so we start by just coming to azurestandard.com, the main website. And if you don't already have an account, then you'll come over to the right side of the screen and you'll create one. It's very easy. Um, the main page always shows you what's on sale and um, highlights some of the products that they happen to have. Sometimes they don't have everything. Um, thinking more along the lines of like produce, um, they like to do a lot of seasonal produce, so that's always super helpful. Okay, at the top of your page, once you have an account, you will select where you're gonna pick up your Azure order or whether you're going to um, have it delivered to your house. So you can click your pickup location. It'll ask you to set all this up when you set up your account. And this is what it looks like, okay? So you'll be able to see, you'll be able to put in your zip code and you'll be able to see where the closest pickups are. In this case, the closest pickup to me-ish <laughs> is here. Um, there's actually a new drop that just started that's just over an hour from my house. So um, so I'm not picking up in town or anything. This is still a bit of an about an hour drive. But if you have a group of folks who are also interested in starting with Azure, then you guys can maybe swap off each month and somebody pick it up. Um, it's kind of the system we have worked out. You'll also notice that if that's just not feasible or you don't live close enough to a drop, you can select delivery. And see, so you give it a range here, and that I assume depends on how much stuff you're ordering, how many 50 pound bags <laughs> you'll have coming to your house. So um, you have choices here. And you can also see that you can select a pickup date. So typically, pickup dates are once a month. So you can choose to create your order for the, the one coming up most quickly, or you can select the following month. Okay, and we'll talk about the ordering process. Just because you click this does not mean that you're absolutely in it to pick up um, that particular month. So we'll talk about what all that looks like. So you can either pick up from a drop or you can have it delivered to your house. It's really gonna be what's the best option for you. Okay, next piece of information is the cutoff. So I have 19 days to finish my order before it cuts off for the May order. And sometimes I, sometimes I remember, sometimes I don't. Azure is actually very good about sending reminder emails when there's just a few days left before the cutoff. So I found that to be super helpful. And while the cutoff is in 19 days, the actual pickup will be the week of May 26th. And so the actual pickup date is, uh, you won't really get that until about a week before, but most, um, most pickups are gonna run about the same day. I think ours is usually on a Friday, but I know another one that's fairly close will, um, I think it always runs on a Tuesday. So there starts to be a pattern, but you just need to be kind of flexible. This is where it's helpful if you and some other friends are all ordering from Azure and you can uh, take turns picking up the order once a month. So if you get with a few friends, then chances are you might only have to pick up once every three months or so. Um, that's very helpful. Okay, so a couple of things if you're going to order. You can always click the what's on sale. I love to do that. You can use the search bar to put in just um, what exactly you're looking for. If you're going to get a majority of your groceries from your local store and you're just going to use Azure for specialty things, I use uh, Azure for a lot of grains and things like that, then you're just going to type in exactly what you're looking for. And they even have fresh produce, like in this case, ginger, but you'll see I put it in there and you get all kinds of things, not just fresh ginger, but dried, minced, um, something you might find at the store, and then also things that have ginger in them, like granola, things like that. Um, they will also tell you what's on sale. So let's go back. If you're if you're big into sale shopping like I am, you can click on the what's on sale and it'll show you for this month, these are the items that are discounted. Um, just like a regular store. Azure has its own line of some products and I have had great results with all of those. Um, oh look, they have apricots on sale. I had to get those. Um, they have also started carrying 
uh, supplements. Here you've got collagen, turmeric, um, trace minerals, that kind of thing. So if you take supplements anyway and you've been looking for a good way to get those at a low cost, it might be something that you're interested in. Okay, not only do they carry food, let's back up, but they also have plant starts during this season. Um, there's dairy, there's frozen frozen foods, there's meats. So keep all that in mind with what whatever you're ordering so that you have a cooler on hand for when you go to pick it up and you have enough freezer space because you can get a box of like 20 frozen chickens. So just make sure that you um, have room for it. Okay, so once you have filled up your cart, let's grab a few of these things. Let me go to what I normally go to. So Okay, so we'll just say I'm gonna order some einkorn and you'll see they have different options. So just make sure you pay attention to the description of each. So if I just wanna get myself a five pound bag, I'm gonna add it to cart. Okay, so you're gonna add everything that you want to your cart and then you can click on it, okay? And it'll give you um, a rundown of everything that you have and you'll notice that just because it's in your cart doesn't mean you've checked out. Okay, you can go ahead and check out and then you can add to your order until the cutoff date. So if you're thinking, um, oh goodness, I needed to add two pounds of butter, then you can come back and do that until the cutoff. And then notice it says that your card won't be charged until your order ships. Um, so that's really helpful. Uh, you can earn cash, uh, Azure, Azure cash with, with each order. Um, just kind of a little incentive there and once you place your order like I said your card won't be charged until then another perk of using Azure is if you share it with friends you can earn a $25 credit so this is just a really good incentive if you like Azure and you really want to share it with your friends then you can get yourself a link and you can share it with them and then it adds that $25 to your account which helps when you do your monthly ordering um, it's just an incentive program and it's helpful so I've I've recommended several people to Azure and they have really liked it and but the you're not, it's not like a Sam's Club or Costco where you have to have a membership. Um, anybody can order from it and you don't have to order every month. That's actually what I really love about it is that it, you just, I haven't ordered in the last two months because I haven't really needed anything. I do now. And so you can just order when you want. There's no push to order each month to get to order a certain amount or anything like that. So I hope that you found this an easy way to learn how to order from Azure Standard. If you have questions about any of the products, feel free to leave that in the comments below and I'll do my best to um, answer those for you. I've been ordering for several years and have been, been really pleased um, with everything that I've gotten. I haven't had any issues and I've done fresh produce all the way to my grains um, and even some dairy and things like that. So yeah, if you got questions, let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, um, I hope you give it a try. See what you think.